Sounds like Sounds Roots, like Roots toothy, toothy bastard, bastard under control. control. Better oh, not come back here. I'd be working on your mech. Or else. Or else. <laughs> I'm Groot. Oh, oh, nice. nice. You made a cute little pen. You didn't need to chew up the conk, did you? for your thoughts what is a penny uh, it's money like units the saying means I'd pay to know what you're thinking we must use our currency to pay the Nova Corps fine or we risk Drax just tell me what's up I that the Seknarf 9 was not what I expected because Lady Hellbender isn't a giant she is definitely not that is only part of it Peter Quill on our way to her fortress I Realize that many of my assumptions about this team have been incorrect as well. Really? The assassin and the rodent. Without them and the tree fighting nobly beside us, we would not be alive right now. I told you, they're not bad people just because they have... Things are never simple. On Katath, it was. I had a family that I cherished and a certainty about life that I no longer possess. I'm sure you'll find it again. Just give it some time. Ah, a fitting musical accompaniment for the situation. Mora, did you find... <gasps> Are those dolls? Yes. No. It doesn't matter. The Halosope's in the Teo system. Coordinates are in your console. So, why'd you close the view screen? None of your business. Isn't it, though? Sounds like you're trying to hide something from us. Yes, I am. Hey, you put it that way. So you said Corral's in the Teo system. Any idea what's out there? It looks like her ship is docked at a Novacore station called The Rock. Wow. Do they have another one named The Jazz? I don't think so. Thankfully, the docking procedure is automated at the station. No need to wait for Rocket to fix the comms. Time's ticking away, Peter. Okay, Corel, get ready to be impressed. Corel is probably monitoring this ship, waiting to see if we make the right choice. Looks like your girlfriend held up her end of the bargain, Quill. We know for sure it's her. Checking. Same designation as before. It's definitely Halas Hope.
my ship. Relax. Standard Nova Corps procedure. My ship's fine. Which part? Ask Quill. He's the one who keeps crashing. It. All right. Let's pay that fine. Take bets on if Quill's gonna get back with Cop Lady? No, and Corral, that would be surprising. Groot. Groot, really? Rocket'll come around, just try not to eat anything else, okay? Okay, here we go. They so much as scratched her paint. We get Nova Corps to reduce our fine. Good luck with that. It's gross negligence. Negligence. That's what I said. Where is everybody? Most Nova stations are heavily automated, all synchronized by the world mind. M ship. Designation Milano. Move whoa, to holding whoa, space whoa. R734 Get back here with my ship. PL. Present validated ticket to kiosk what? prior to ticket? departure. Relax, Rocket. It's standard procedure. You keep saying that. This isn't exactly my first Nova Corps find. Yours either. First time I'm paying one. we got to talk to, the better. Your suspicion of law enforcement is itself suspicious. Forgive me if I don't like taking orders from a giant space computer. Okay, it's not supposed to be this empty. Is it a holiday? Space cops don't take holidays. Hello? I'm We're here to pay a fine? Looking for Centurion Corral? Door's locked. Well, we tried. Come on, let's go. We're not leaving. We'll go to them if we have to. Look, the door controls are on the other side if we can get you there. So what, now I'm supposed to hack Nova Corps security? I mean, if you don't think you can... Keep shot, Quill. We are discussing breaking into a Nova Corps facility. It ain't breaking in if no one's here. is precisely when one would break in. Perhaps this is a test to see if we will respect the bureaucratic process. Well, newsflash, I don't. Perhaps we simply need to wait our turn. Highly doubt it. Hey, Drax, get me a can of Power Star, would you? The machine is inoperable, and I am not in the habit of lending units. I never said I'd pay you back. All right, there's an air duct in here. Could be a way in, Rocket. Could, sure. Or maybe it drops down into the hangar. Hey, Gamora. Think you can squeeze through this vent? If you can get it open, I ain't that flexible. Ain't this the way? Never a space cop when you need one. I'd settle for a desk clerk. I'd settle for us leaving a note and getting the Flark off his rock. Thirsty big guy? This machine appears to be inoperable. Maybe they're just all out of your flavor. I'm Shut 
your mouth. We're supposed to be leaving. What? <sighs> Groot says there's an air duct in the room with the controls. If there's one on this side, I may be able to get through. Yep, it's locked. Thanks for taking my work. Odd. What is? I mean, besides all of this. There's nothing. Not even a welcome screen. It is on, right? They're always on. Constant connection to the world mind. That's the point. This one's been severed. Huh. Any chance they're all just on break? I am Groot. Groot says the kiosk still says open. I say it ain't our problem. Open air duct. Now we have damaged Nova Corps property. Eh, just a little. All right, Rocket. See if this vent leads into that other room. And be careful. You know, I still don't love this whole they are fine plan, but I gotta say, that's what the Nova Corps tech ain't a bad consolation. There's something screwy with the power grid. It's like they're on backup only. I'm sinking the schematic to your visor. You could do this the whole time? Follow the circuits and let me know which junctions to switch. We'll have to pick and choose where we reroute power. Prepare to be amazed. Hey, I think I can set off the sprinklers from this thing. Does that help? Only if you want to get wet. Yeah, good point. Uh, Quill, you still there? Ow! Clark and Nova Scott! I didn't trip something, I just rerouted something a little prematurely. Let's go! Clark and right I can. Watch him, this thing's got false positives all over the place. I'll have to do a relay. Is that supposed to mean anything to us? No. I just wanted you to know how difficult it is. We'll find out. Oh ho ho, clever. But I'll bet you didn't think of this. Prepare to be amazed. Oops! Oops, what? Nothing. It's fine. Maybe, uh, just don't touch. There. Fixed! I do not care to think of how many monsters we will need to sell to pay off this fine. We're in plain view of security, and no one's come running. That's a door. The wrong door. Hey, hey it's a bathroom. Anybody got to go? The only place I want to go is out of here. Clark and right, I can. We'll find out. Prepare to be amazed. Clark and right, I can. Watch 
Mission learned. We'll find out. Prepare to be amazed. Sort of worked. The blast door is going to need some extra juice. Keep there another power jump. Watch and learn. Presto! What else? You know, ta da! That is no more clear. Doors open. Why did you not simply say so? It is conspicuously silent. Good point. Hey, Nova! What are they doing? Scanning each other. Far to find know why, though. They're acting bonkers. How have we not run into a single Nova Corps? Perhaps they are in a meeting. All of them? In my experience, meetings involve an inordinate amount of people and take longer than is necessary. The whole station can't be uninhabited. It is not uninhabited. It is inhabited by robots. I like it better this huh. way. Looks like everything was normal when Hallow's Hope oh. showed up. Maybe that's where they are. Yeah, collectively kissing your ex's butt. Oh, poor little guy. It is a thing. Your sympathies are redundant. Hey, I'm oh, half there. thing, remember? I did not. There. You hear that? Uh, hey there. What gave it away? Hey, jumpsuit. You gotta get me out of here. I don't belong in the cage. Nova Corps begs to differ. Well, no one asked you, scary eyes. We should not be aiding and abetting a criminal. Weren't you a Nova Corps prisoner? Indeed, and I served my time. What are you in for? What? Nothing. In case of mistaken identity. They mistook me for someone who gave a crap. Ooh, I like him. Get back at you, weasel. So how about helping a guy out? See if there's a door release or something. Do we really want to pay this fine and go back to being broke? Hey, hang on, where'd he go? What would it take to call an entire station away? So we're just gonna leave that guy to rot? The last thing we need is to get caught freeing some criminal. Now this place brings back memories. You once served with the Nova Corps, Peter Quill. What are you doing? I figured as long as we're here, I may as well try and dig up some juicy Nova secrets. Maybe they even got a bead on Gamora's bluer hat. Not likely. What's that? Nothing. Hey, do you guys hear that? What? It's the death rattle of all the things we could be spending those units on. This door's locked. I formally declare my objection to trespassing in the Nova Corps facility. Noted. See? I'm getting a real haunted mansion vibe from this place. Uh, elevator's out. But the shaft above looks open. We can use it to climb up there. Please don't fall. Oh, crap! <laughs> okay. Piece of cake. Ooh, spooky.
what you were to. Are these... Centurion armor. Yup. Feel free to try one on, Quill. A true warrior requires no armor. You wouldn't fit in one anyway. For real? Can I try one? <laughs> if you want to get fried through a puddle of goo, each one is gene-coded by the world mind. Are you saying the world mind has the genetic code of every Nova Centurion? Yup. Word is, the bugs tried to use that against them in the war. But that's one supercomputer you can't have. Believe me, I tried. This looks like the only way forward. Are you blind? I didn't sign up for getting chopped at two just so you could make your... your ah! No wonder the doors all torn down. Alright, let's hope that holds. How come this one gets its own room? Looks like a workshop. You know, I hear they anodize these things with some kind of Zendarian smart metal. Metal cannot be smart. Smarter than some. Subcutaneous emitter is busted. Hmm. Whatever that is. That means something to you? Maybe. It means it can't report back to the world mind. That checks out with what I saw in the lobby. It's more fun crafting my stuff, but I'll lend you a paw. One tick, done. And voila, I've made it foolproof, just for you. The House Hope is a capital ship. Maybe they're all there for some reason. Or maybe this whole place is contaminated with barbarian fox. I am experiencing a mild itching sensation. Yeah, and I got a real pain in my ass. It ain't spooky. That big haunted house on Dervani was spooky. One has nothing to do with the other. Rocket? Do your magic. No. What? I said no. When are you gonna come to your senses, Quill? I am Quill. And then what? He's gonna drag us halfway through this station if we let him. Okay. We try one more room, and if we still haven't found anything, we leave. Deal? Fine. One more room, not two. One. We ain't going back that way. 
I thought the Nova Corps had more ships. I heard they got, uh, staffing ships. From who? People. In places with, uh, other people. Peter Quill. I found this. Sector 1, check in. Sector 1, sweep complete. 75% acceptance rate. It is as she promised. Have faith. The promise will be made real. Proceed to Sector 7. With faith. Well, the good news is we're not alone. There's lots of chatter. Tell them I want my ship back. My ship. I sense there's a butt. But it sounds like they're searching for something or someone. Could explain why no one's around. Well, who gives a flark? Tell them to get their golden butts up here. The promise will be made real. Proceed to Sector 7 with faith. Sector 3, check in. Sweep of Sector 3. Uh, hey there. Is this thing on? We're, uh, we're looking for Centurion Corral. We're the Guardians of the Galaxy. We were supposed to meet Centurion Corral to pay a fine. Hello, Guardians of the Galaxy. I would be more than happy to assist you today. Where are you now? We're, uh, in some sort of monitoring station. Understood. Stay where you are. We will come to you. Well, what did they say? They're coming to us. Huh. It's about flark and time. Where's Centurion Corral? Have faith. She is not with us at this time. Have faith? Really? Anyone else seeing a purple glow around these guys? I do not trust them. If there's an alternative plan, now may be the time to execute it. I am Groot. Come. What do you mean there's no Centurion Corral? Her ship's literally docked outside. I understand your confusion. We will set your tumultuous souls at ease. Come, Guardians of the Galaxy. We will take you to the Hallas Hope. Then you too can have faith. We shall return to the ship. Yep. That's how you want to play this? Bring it on. Reflect well on our find. I don't see that matters now. With that door flarked, we gotta go out the way they came in. Let's just find Corral. I'm sure she'll know what's going on. Yeah, if you don't try and kill us like the last lot. No way. Not Corral. Oh, Looks like a standoff. Flark. was a standoff. Not good. Flark. Nova killing Nova. Which side won? There's your answer. Oh, man. This is bad. We're sitting down. I will not stand here and wait to die. None of us got a whole lot of choice. Oh! Fork and Meathead. Nice knowing you. Oh! Oh, damn it, Drax. Can you handle that many? Not much we can do about it now. Can't this thing go any faster? You're lucky it ain't turning really? to the ground after being shot up like that. I should have just jumped. Yeah, because that's what we need. Two idiots! Ground floor! Get ready for a fight! Don't forget about Drax. We need to make sure he's okay. I just wanted to see Centurion Corral! Yeah! Don't get between Quill and his pop girl! I'll enjoy We need you on your feet, big guy!
time is irrelevant. There, kill, now! Ah, that is much more informative. Those who resist must My be great strength goes underutilized! <laughs> Killing it out there, Quill. Look on their faces when they see you razoring down from on high. Done. Hold fast! 
These renegades are relentless! All right! I'm good! That's what string them up, Bruce! Oh. I'm ready! Just find me an opening! I'm on it! They are undeserving of the Nova Corps uniform! Says the guy with no return! You're a big guy! Die with honor! I do not think our fine will be paid today. You don't say. Guys, Quill's ship is right there. We just need to... What? What do we need to do, Quill? A whole bunch of whacked out space cops just tried to vaporize us. And you want to go looking for a rematch? Because your girlfriend might be in trouble? That's not what I'm doing, and she's not my girlfriend. Could have fooled me. Rocket! The only thing that this is about is getting our ship back. We find Corel, and then none of this is our problem anymore. You're right! It won't be our problem anymore. Because we didn't sign up to be run around halfway across the galaxy by a, a cop love and heal me! I approved! Come on! Seriously, Corel? Join the Guardian, she said. It'll be good for your mental health, she said. <sighs> All right. Listen to Flark up. Groot and I are getting off this dast rock. Anyone who'd like a ride can follow us. Everyone else can go to hell. I prefer the rodent's plan. So try. Find the invaders. None must escape. How did the all-knowing world mind not foresee this event? They're just a computer, not God. Rocket, come on! You come on! I told you we should have left! And we are! I'm on board! Let's find the Milano the and- Intruders reported in the repair bay! And try not to die in the process! First sensible thing you said, all cycle! How long do I have to listen to you two squabbling? We're not squabbling, we're just- Stand down! Intruders and <laughs> seek a kiss! Off the battlefield, Peter Quill. Our enemies are melting before us. 
<laughs> like butter on a hot knife. <laughs> Somebody bring me some bread. I have fought many battles, my friends, but none so magnificent as this. <laughs> it is magnificent, Drax. Unbelievably, insanely magnificent. <laughs> right? Like a fork and supernova. So stay on track, keep your eyes open, and shoot for the stars. Who's with me? Feel my wrath! We are! Let's... Deadliest woman in cover! This is not where I thought this day was going. Huh. Hey, you said we needed to go up, right? More up than this, but it's a start. Never thought I'd be fighting Novacore again. They are no longer Novacore. Yeah, this don't count. But who or what are they? What's with that glowing? Screw once. Let's keep our noses out of it. Hey, we can get through here. Yo, fit, just suck it in. Maybe Corel took her ship back to Xandar to report. Look, are they praying? What the hell have we wandered into? Check out that big guy. Don't look like no Nova to me. It's a sorcerer. Behold the magic flowing to the altar. There's no such thing as magic, right? Come on. Let's get moving before these whack drops spot us. It's like we stumbled on some creepy cult. I told you, it ain't our problem. It will be if they've taken over Nova Corps. No Nova, no fine. No problem. We should probably tell someone. Yeah, tell it to your diary. Come on, down here. How do you know? I don't. I'm just putting distance between us and those whack drops. Nice to see you listening for a change. You cannot see listening. Don't you start with me, Muscles. You're still mostly in my good books. So, you think... Yeah, I'll deal with the door. Whoa! Urge the Faithless! Uh, Lark and Scott! Can nothing go easy! Yeah. Oh. These oh. renegades are relentless! an awfully nice picture. <laughs> There's no way we lose today, Quill. Seriously? That's what you're gonna do when these clowns turn it all upside down. What are we doing? Uh, doesn't matter, because I say no. No guts, no glory. If you want to succeed, you gotta fight and bleed for your needs. So who's with me? That's Here we go! Overwhelmed! Time's up! Time's up! 
Second guessing of just sure. These doors have been barricaded. Means someone at least tried to resist. Bad lot of good it did them. We don't know that. There could still be others on the station. Or maybe those were the survivors who fled on the Hallows Hope. Were we in the same elevator? Gamora's right. At least I hope she is. They can't all be dead. They ain't. Most of them switched sides. I mean, some of them must have escaped. You were referring to your former lover and the child. I've got to believe Corral was on that ship. Yeah, well, believing don't make it so. What would make Nova turn on Nova? All right, hangar, here we come. What the flark was that docking number? R73-4PL. Are you serious? Always. You're my new favorite person, Muscles. I am Groot. No, not really. There she is. Come to Papa. 4PL, done. All right, bay is clear, extending catwalks, and... Flark! What's up? The clamps won't release. Those whack jobs must have triggered a lockdown. Can you override it? Wouldn't be much of a lockdown if I could. I can hold her in position and get the engines warmed up, but you're gonna have to release those clamps manually. All right, release the clamps and don't die. All faithful, converge on the central hangar. None these can rebels. escape her life. Try to keep them off you! Surely true number four would not fall this easily! Well, how exactly do we release these things? What am I, a user's manual? They shoot the fucking thing! Put down! Focus on getting the engine started! Stick these guys with mine! There's another one! Alright, I'm hooked into the Milano system! Where's my tunes? I got your scuddy terror music! We've got more incoming! Someone tell Bruna! Now what? 
We should set course for Contraxia. They bear our issues over a cold catastrophe. I don't hate it, but... We should report what we saw first, right? Because that's our biggest problem, Quill. Come on, Groot, we got Scott to do. Rocket! What's with him? The abomination is never happy. Rocket's got a point, though. Our comms are flarked, the trackers still count him down, and Corel could be anywhere in the universe. It's not looking good. We are in the place between hard rocks. You mean a rock and a hard place? That is what I said. Helen knows we could use a night off. So, Contraxia? We should go to nowhere instead. Ah, another suitable location to partake in liberal libations. To report what we saw. Me and Cosmo go way back. He's chief of security. He'll make sure the right people know about the rock. And the tracker and fine? Rocket's got a guy in nowhere. We kill two birds with one stone. Okay. I'll set the coordinates. Maybe... talk to Rocket? Peter Quill, what does killing two birds with one stone signify? It means solving two problems with a single solution. Ha! I knew it! There are no birds on nowhere. Depends if she are count. Saw a few of them last time. Perhaps we should consume the rest of our food rations before we reach nowhere, to make room for new ones. I'll pass. You were not hungry? I already checked the cupboard. All we've got left are number five ration packs. Ah, uh, yes. The dehydrated eggs are foul. Can't believe Quill's such a boot -looker. What's with his obsession with bending over for Novacore? Respect them? Please. Uh, I'm sorry, Drax. I thought paying her fine would make things better, but it just made things more complicated. Do not apologize, Peter Quill. Our encounter with Novacor has given me clarity of purpose. We must investigate and fight whoa, this- Whoa, whoa there, Drax. We ain't fighting Novacor if we can help it. We'll just let Cosmo handle this. The soldiers we encountered were not acting like Novacor officers. And those robed priests, it was all very disturbing. I need to clear my mind. This book is not helping. Quill really cared about this team. He wouldn't get turned around as soon as the next girlfriend walked into the room. I am not! We almost got killed back there. I almost got killed trying to get this ship back. Hey, uh, guys? What's up? Nothing at all, Quill. Not a thing. Uh, something wrong with Groot? Nope. He's just, uh, defoliating. Seasonal thing. Come on, I know you're lying. You guys are planning something. What we do ain't none of your business. Leave us alone, Quill. Uh, Rocket? Flark off, Quill! Come on, guys. I am Groot. Groot says, go away. Let's talk about it. Leave us alone. Groot, reason with him. Groot don't want to talk to you. Rocket. Groot. Guys. Rocket. Groot? Guys.
device. Rocket. Groot. Do you ever ponder how different your lives would have been had you joined the Nova Corps? You asking me or Peter? Both. I don't think either of us would have fared very well. Gonna have to ask Groot about this when he's free. Assassin, you believe the events unfolding aboard the Rock qualify as a mutiny, correct? Look pretty obvious to me. Even if the officers who rebelled were under the influence of a Materia Four. It doesn't really change that they rejected Nova Corps orders and started killing their shipmates. I find it repulsive. So those coordinates. They're in your console. Got it. Nowhere here we come. Nowhere. Last spaceport on the edge of the known universe and home to the best black market deals you can find. And surprisingly good noodles. You ever wondered what kind of person found it was like, Oh look! The severed head of a giant celestial being. Let's drill holes in it and live inside. They wanted the brain tissue. Very rare. Very valuable. The marketplace came after. Along with noodles. You are certain this Cosmo is trustworthy, Peter Quill? Of course. He's chief of security. <laughs> and nowhere. And as such, probably deals with Nova Corps all the time. Trust me. He's gonna want to know about the rock. What are they doing back there? Shenanigans, likely. See you never, flark bags! Are Rocket and Groot, did they really leave? Yes. It looks like it. Do we know where they went? You're the last one who talked to them. Yeah, Rocket seemed pissed off. Wonder if Rocket and Groot will be back to pick up the stuff they left behind. Guess you were right. Turns out we couldn't trust those guys. I still have faith that the tree will bring the rodent to reason. So, Drax, where do you want to partake in liberal libations? At least you're still here. I wouldn't want to miss your meeting with Cosmo. Try to behave while we're gone, okay? Maybe when we get back, I'll ask Groot to give you a bath. Can't we get going already? I hope Nowhere's Chief of Security will intervene to assist Novacor, the station we visited. It perturbs me still. Fine, whatever. We'll talk to Cosmo and then we'll go out and have a good time. Like I said, we go way back. Plus, he's probably already heard about what's happening. All we do is confirm the rumor. Maybe he'll even give us a reward. Spaceport seems busier than normal. War always moves the poor. I kind of think it adds to the charm of the place. I can't wait to see the rift. Didn't think 
I'd miss nowhere this much. The attachment we feel to certain places, people. them. They left. What am I supposed to do? Chase them down and beg them to come back? You could apologize. That's your advice? The apology does not need to be sincere. I guess if we ever see him again. Big if, by the way. But if it happens, then maybe I might think about it. Anyway, once we let Cosmo know what's happening out there, we'll have more time to think about what to do with Rocket. If Rocket doesn't come back, we'll need a contingency plan for getting rid of the Nova Tracker. Why? We have not yet spent our ill-gotten gains. Hmm. We could still pay the fine. But we'd have to go all the way to New Xandar to do it. What if we get there and it's compromised too? There's gotta be someone shady enough in the market who can help. Maybe. But Cosmo deals with Nova Corps all the time. Maybe we can pay the fine through him. had dealings with this Cosmo murderess. We've circled back to that name, have we? As a statement of fact, you are by trade an assassin. Hey there, I need to talk to Cosmo. He in his tower? Should be. You know the way? Straight to the market. Cosmo again. I guess I kind of miss the old boy. How exactly do you know him? Was he also a prisoner of the Chitauri? Nope. We met right here. Back when I was in the Ravagers. Dishonorable killers and thieves. The Ravagers actually did some good during the war. Anyway, Cosmo sniffed out a scheme me and Yondu had cooking. He threatened to throw the both of us in jail. I've heard he keeps things on a pretty tight leash. <laughs> He does, but it turns out we're both from Earth, so he gave me a second chance. Keep an eye on your things. These kooks are a bit hands-on, if you know what I mean. Every decision has to go through There are people who claim to be able to see the future, sure. Do you mind? You're making me uncomfortable. Your planetary chakras are very Must be mistaken. I'm doing great. <laughs> Soothsayers on Katath are unable to predict its demise. No one could predict what Thanos would do. Mad Titan will pay for everything that he has. <laughs> Mantis, what are you? Do you still have those suicidal urges? What? No? And you thought joining a team would be bad for you. Hi. Sunlord, right? You're the rock star? It's Star Lord. Hey, that's right. I forget which version of you I've met. Did you do the thing yet? What is the thing she is referring to? No idea. Hi. I don't know if we've met yet. I'm. No. No, no, no. It's not. Oh, oh, you poor. No, he's lying. I mean, oh. By the Kodati he wrote, the broken promise of all will be mended. Less depressed. Thanks. Don't worry. It's always weird the first time. Celestial Madonna! Ah. Uh, Hi, guys. You should not be in this place. Actually, I'm exactly where I need to be. I think. No. Yes, this is where I need to be. Or needed to be. Am needed, yes. Wait, why are you here? You cannot keep leaving the sanctuary. It's not safe. 
There are rumblings in the galaxy. <laughs> when aren't there rumblings in the galaxy? <laughs> yeah, okay. You're gonna keep making that face. It was nice seeing you again, Gamora. Star guy. Green meanie. Okay, bye. So, Gamora, you and Mantis seem close. We've met. Okay. We're being evasive, woman. Wait, woman? That's the nicest thing you've ever called me. Anyone ever tell you you're an open book? Hardcover or paperback? I just meant Mantis mentioned a few things. Mantis says a lot of things. They don't always make sense. Until they do. That insect woman was odd. I understand your reluctance to discuss her. Don't you stop? Mantis is strange, but she means well. I think she does, anyway. It's a wonder this head hasn't this? collapsed in on itself yet. Sometimes I think the sleaze is the only thing holding nowhere to go. to bring them back here? Not necessary. Transport will be waived once you've captured the target. That'll work. We'll be in touch. Ah, let's go, Groot. What's the big idea, man? Think you got me confused with somebody else, pal? Come on, Rocket. Let's talk about this. <laughs> Can you believe this guy? You can't just quit. We need you. Oh, well, uh, I don't need you. Find some other sucker to keep your shit together. You're more than just... I know that blonde mop anywhere. Eat a queer. <laughs> uh, actually, maybe we can stick around for a bit. Last time I see you, you was running away from Mordelia with your britches off and done. Get ready for a fight. I'm always ready. What the? I don't know what's going on here, but I thought we was friends, Eta. Or did you? Get about me. No, 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 I, uh, I don't remember meeting you, man. Sorry. How the hell could you forget? Look, look, there was a couple of years there where uh, things got a little bit blurry, okay? There. You know, picking up missions, strange women, alien alcohol. So just like now? I can't believe this. You and me, storm riders, together till the end. What is he talking about? Oh, 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 it's a song, right? It is. Of course it's a song. The one that was playing when Peter and me made our unbreakable blood oath. We did? Breakable blood oath? That is a serious commitment, Peter Quill. Oh, no, 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 whoa, whoa, wait, 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 of course, I, I remember. You, you me, uh, the, the, the music. Tells you what, Peter. How about you and me? Storm ride together! One. More time. Here we go. You, uh, you know to sing a song. Do 
together till the end, gotta finish the fight. Cause this storm gonna rage till the end of the night. Come on, Rita! Together! Rolling like a chain ride. Storm! The storm riders! Storm riders! Storm riders! Storm riders! Very naughty. Bartender, get me a cocktail stick. I need to poke my ears out. Come on, man. What? Let's see the next line. More! Together till the end, now we look to the sky. Lightning strikes twice, now we toss to the fly. Same with me, Vita. Driving through Ooh, the pouring rain. Ride the storm. Storm ride For Flark's sake, let's go, Groot. You running the ravages now? I hear Yonder's doing time in the kill. <laughs> Me? Me? No, I, I got a new crew now. You? Still doing that, uh, thing you do? No, sorry. Novacore. Now my partner on Molivia. Um, but that's okay. I, uh, got a new business partner now. Into animal husbandry, you can say. Huh? <laughs> Which reminds me, I best be going. Oh, really bad. Huh? Well, listen, Peter, I uh, want to apologize for almost hitting you. Oh, oh I would have uh, right in the head. Oh. But that's not the way to treat a storm rider, is it? All right, so I got you this instead. Uh, what is it? The ticket for Collector's Emporium. Yeah? I bought it thinking I'd have time! Wow, thanks, man. That's awesome. Yeah, my pleasure. And remember... Ride the storm. Storm ride. <laughs> okay. Bye. Nice one, Peter. <laughs> <laughs> Could have been worse. The rodent left the... Great. You said it. But at least you have them. Aww. Yeah. Do we just Open have a moment? House. Tell the really? others and I Thanks. slit your throat. And there she like is. You. If you hadn't talked him down, I'd have to close up. With the biohazard game, it will clean your brains off everything. Right. Thanks, I guess. Down infinite. This place brings back memories. You mean hangovers? Yep. Last time we were here, that Sakaran was no pushover. I can still taste those fermented spike eggs you made me try. Remind me never to challenge you to a drinking contest. Lots more ghosts hanging around. Someone is making them come back. I thought I was going to be spending. You want to know a secret? I'm just an illusion. A specter. I'm not really here. I couldn't tell. You look real enough to me. You want to know another secret? Something big is happening. Something great. I'm telling you. Do you want to hear about...
rocketing group picking up a job. Look that way, yeah. You don't really think he's serious about quitting, do you? You'll cool off. <clears throat> I need to leave. Uh, something wrong? It's not your business, Peter Quill. Do not wait for me. There's a Drax! Watch it, Star Lord! Watch yourself, jerky red guy! Can you believe that? Talk to Cosmo alone. Got a lot of parts here. Ooh, just about everything. <laughs> Mostly. Refurbished, of course. Hard to get new equipment since the war. Well. You looking for something particular? I wonder if you have something I could use to remove a uh, Nova Core Disabler. 7 A12 series. 2G2, maybe? Ah, nope. That one's decommissioned. I know. I got something that should work no matter what. <laughs> On second thought, I better let my tech guy make the decisions. If he ever comes back. Send him by when you can. Again, anyway. Greatest collection of gifts in the galaxy. Ah, oh, welcome, welcome, welcome. You, lucky traveler, have arrived at the Elastoria Symporium, private collection of Tanalir Tivan, the premier, premier, premier exhibit of wonders in the galaxy. Most would hoard these treasures, but not Mr. Tivan. He is so, so, so generous. He wishes to share them with the common people. Would you, you, you like to take the tour? I'd love a tour. Oh, I have this. Think I get him for free, right? Oh my, you must be a very important person. Mr. Tivan does not give these out very, very, very often. Please enjoy the Emporium. Welcome to the Emporium gift shop. I do hope, hope, hope you enjoyed the Emporium. Be sure to come back soon, as you never, never, never know what you might find. Commemorate your visit with a unique souvenir. What is this place? You have stumbled into the wonderful Emporium's gift shop. Would you like to purchase a souvenir? We have some very unique items. Maybe. What kind of things do you sell? Replicas of very rare items. Figures and effigies from lost civilizations. Objedar, in other words. Figures? Like dolls? 
There's a member of my crew, a woman, who might like that kind of thing. A boorish person might call them dolls. But that is neither here nor there. Tell me more about this person. She, uh, also likes swords. Oh, not what does she like. What is she like? Oh, distant and tough. But I think maybe there might be some squishy bits in her somewhere. Ah, oh, I believe I have the perfect item. What do you think? Would you like to make a purchase? It's just the right kind of creepy. She should love it. A magnificent choice. I presume you will forgo the silk gift wrap. Yeah, this is fine as is. Very well. Enjoy your purchase. Good day. Enjoy the wonders of the Emporium. Kinda neat. Not good. No way. How'd they get that? Dude, no way. about that, me and Cosmo understand each other. games where I have no chance of winning, is it? Captain, Captain, Captain. Don't you know your onions, Captain? The good Bolshevik cleaned up the boardwalk. No grip, no crap, no cheats, no cons, no sir. So I can win. How about this, Captain? We play a friendly low stakes game just to prove that I'm on the up to milk. What do you say, Captain? What do you say? I'm in, but don't try anything funny. Not me, Gavin, not me. I run my game straight as an arrow. See, the ball's in this cup. Now, keep your eyes glued as it moves. 
All right, all right. The cup. Uh, the middle one. Well, I'll be. You got it, Captain. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Congratulations. You got a sharp pair of peepers. Here's your winnings. See, my game's on the level and plumb true. A game of chance means you always have a chance to win. Yes, you're right. Sharp as a tack, Captain. How about we play again? Maybe raise the stakes just a smidgen? Uh, I better not. I'm not feeling very lucky right now. My team, my friends, they... Sorry to hear that, Captain. Can't really help you there, but I can offer you a bit of destruction. Terran detected. Alter sales profile. Dialogue or 6 TF. Skip right up, skip right up. Easy money. You there, Captain. Bandit. Hard to say, but it looks like it's almost ready to pay out. going to be irresponsible. Looks like Becca Moore is watching you right now. As I have said, you are not responsible. What's wrong, honey? You look terrible. This is a place to forget your troubles. Got one thing left to do, and then I plan on doing some serious forgetting. What is that smell? Maybe a gaudy bauble will make me feel better. Eh, better not. I'd have to carry it around with me all day. to resist. Everything is so shiny. No. I was right the first time. I don't need this.
Drax, bud. Is everything all right? You believe that this is the edge of the universe, Peter Quill? Well, yeah, because it is. So, uh, this is the thing you had to do? Come to the observation deck to look at the rift? No. I came to honor the memory of my family. They died without meaning. Or honor. I think I know what you mean, man. My mom won the, uh, Shatara game. She also died for no reason. They just... just shot her. But at least she's in a better place now. Right? In Katathian religion, we believe that in order to reach Untaf, one must lead a life filled with purpose. Failure to do so results in banishment to Sarduth. Our families have been cast out of paradise, Peter Quill, and into nothing. Whoa, whoa, wait. Wherever my mom is, it's not out there, okay? She was a good person. How do you know? Because I just know, all right? If she's anywhere, it's in heaven. She doesn't just deserve to... ...stop being. If you do not mind, Peter Quill... ...I would like to be left alone now. Oh. Yeah. Sure, man. No problem. I'll catch you back at the ship. Cosmos in the office. Bridge closed. Go away. Doesn't look closed. Sisu. Nowhere security. Super official. Go other way. Ali. Ali. I really need to see Cosmo. Cosmo not in tower. He out there. Star Lord in Ali. Wait, how did you know my name? Go, or end up in Cosmo Prison. You choose. Cosmo! You in here? 
Cosmo! Sure, not weird at all. Cosmo is definitely somewhere in this maze of rotting brain matter. Okay, just gotta find Cosmo, then I can deal with the team, if I can find them. Cosmo? That you? Oh, I hate mazes. Especially stinking brain mazes. Okay, dude. Deep breath. Deep breath. Got here. Watch it, Star Lord. And what's a filthy s hiding's what I think, Garrick. Aye. Terrans always be hiding. Cause everybody knows Terrans are scrawny. And good for evil. Uh, if you're in, we might be into that. <laughs> hey, guy. I get. I get it, man. It's not like you uh, for the ter so What's that word? The. Uh Terran with words on his jacket. Uh, uh, lots of people have jackets. Yeah, but you're the one the lady wanted. So hurry up and die. Wait, the lady ain't want him alive? Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, lady H, whatever Lady Hailbender's paying you, I'll double it. No dice. You don't cross Lady H. Uh, uh, triple. Uh, oh, yeah. I'll triple it. Would it help if I said I was sorry? That's how we make our unit. Anybody think to bring refreshments? Okay, okay. Yep, yeah, yeah, time out. <sighs> Woo! Mark is pumping. <laughs> Guys, it's very clear that we're evenly matched. Ha! No, we ain't. We're completely invincible. Oh, well, that sucks. But we're all professionals here, right? Draw them apart before shooting, Peter! Get 
Got this one, Peter. Let me end it. My blade will not be silent, Burgess. Call me that again and I'll murder you. I am not the enemy, traitor. Come on, guys. They're not the first ones to try us, and they won't be the last. There's been a thousand before them, and they've all found out fast. Guardians don't break. But we do seem to be taking a break. Because, uh... Who's with me? I just can't believe I'm missing Thanos right now. Sick. It's about these zombies that invade Earth, and then it's up to these kids that have to blow them away. Of course you would remember that, and then I ask you if you packed your lunch and you give me a blank stare. I'll be careful, Mom. I always am. Not so fast. Before you go, there's something I want to talk to you about, something I want to give you. Twenty bucks? Don't push it. Think of it as a long overdue gift from your father. It's upstairs on my bed. Go on and get it while I finish up in the kitchen. And we can open it together. Don't you dare touch that dial. Hey, Kubrick, buddy. No matter how long you wait here for Grandma and Grandpa, they're not coming back. Sorry.
I knew you wouldn't wait. Do you know what a birthright is, Peter? It's something that's a part of you. Like your name. Before your father returned to space... Oh, Mom... I know it sounds crazy and that you've never believed me, but... Something has changed. And now more than ever, you need to trust me. And maybe this will help. Easy there, cowboy. These belong to your father. I used to think he left these for our protection. But they might as well be paperweights. Still, if they're enough to convince you of who he really was, then maybe they're protection enough. Protection from what? Your father wasn't just from another planet, Peter. He was... he was important. And important men have enemies. What do you mean, important? He was king. Of an entire world. Called Spartax. Far, far away. And he was a great leader. And the way you look after people, Peter, I know you're going to be just like him. But leading is never easy. Your father left to protect us. And for 13 years it worked. But now something's coming. I know we're being watched. Mom, if you really want to play a game that bad, you could have just said so. I hope I'm wrong, Peter. I really do. But being the son of a king on any planet means that you are going to have a target on your back for the rest of your life. And you're plenty brave. But you're gonna have to be smart, too. I'm gonna let Kubrick out. I'll be right back. That's what he said. Sheesh, no use being pediatric. Oh, crap. 
crap. Would have killed a lot of you. But not you, <laughs> Mr. Big Words. Nope. Lady H won't you alive. Not too alive. Well, then you have failed your mission. Miserably. Peter Quill. These lackluster bounty hunters claim Lady Hellbender hired them to kill us. Hey, we're no slouches. We're part of the league now. You said yourself she'd hunt us to the end of the universe. I had hoped she'd send a monster. Not these two. We would have murderized you. But don't worry. There's more coming. Did you hear that, Peter Quill? A silver lining. Yeah, that's great, Drax. Won't be long in these clouds. Hey, this is Drax. a big mistake. I'm innocent. <clears throat> Cosmo, are you out there? Cosmo! Then you wish we did, kid. Be silent. Nice that you finally showed up. Would have been even nicer if you didn't abandon me in the first place. I never left. One minute, we're having a great time, and the next... Wait a second, did you use me as bait? Huh. Well, your plan worked a little too well, seeing how we're in jail now. We're all in prisons of our own making, Peter. Hello? Cosmo? I really need to use the bathroom. I am Groot. Yeah, get your mitts off of him! Ow! A little butter just scratched me! Oh, I'll do more than that. I'll murderize you. Uh. <laughs> hey, guys. Didn't expect to see you here. Yeah, cram it, Flatnard. Flatnard? Yeah, and a scruff crew in one, too. Shut up and get in there. <sighs> Come on, dude. What's your problem? You are. That's why we quit. I am. Yes, you did. Now stop talking to him. Rocket, buddy, come on. We had a good thing going. You and Groot are better than two-bit bounty hunters. Scoff. What did you say? I said scoff. You don't say scoff, you just scoff. Oh, so now I don't express myself proper like? <sighs> you know what? You're a real piece of buff. <laughs> Rocky, dude, woof. We should have buffed you in when we buffed the chance. <laughs> like, buff we are. You don't, woof, woof, woof. What? You rough in front of me? I told you a bajillion times, I'm not a roughing animal. What were you talking about? You woof. <laughs> Sorceress, this. Where are we? You would have been still on Nord. <laughs> Osmo, how you doing, buddy? We were just about. <laughs> Guardian of Galaxies will tell Cosmo why they broke into Continuum Cortex. Or Cosmo will conjure worse psychic gulag. Broke into the. Do not feed Cosmo. Get biscuits, Peter Quill. You work with Blood Brothers. Create distraction so Pesky Raccoon and Sentient Tree Friend can use Continuum Cortex. Cosmo also know Guardian of Galaxies. Nova Tracker on ship. Okay, I'm sure it's just one big misunderstanding. Right? Right. We're here because something happened on the no oh. Guardian of Galaxy, we're on Nova Rock. Yeah, we went to find Centurion Corral and pay our fine. Why? Strange transmissions spreading across galaxy. Like rabbits in springtime. Cosmo sent many team to investigate, none return. Now Nova Rock sending same signal. Guardian of Galaxy will tell me what they saw. The Nova Corps were killing each other. It was like they were drinking funky juice or something. Or joined the cult. Yeah, during that ritual with the priest. They kept talking about a promise. <laughs> right away, sir. Fraternity of Raptors. Cult of the Negative Zone. Universal Church whoa, 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 of Truth. Stop! <laughs> that's them. That old man that's with them. Shuttle exploded on the Hallis Hope. Grand Unifier Raker. 
leader of the Universal Church of Truths. That name ring bells, Cosmo. His old cult. Very powerful during Galactic War. Now, not so much. You said the rock was transmitting a signal. What if the religion were somehow... And yet, the Universal Church of Truths died with gold skin God. Let us investigate the Hallows Hope for you. What? You said none of your teams return, right? Seems to me like you're short-staffed. And we want to find out what happened as much as you do. We do. So let us investigate for you. Always a catch, Peter Quinn. And not, not fun, fun kind with ball. Ball. <laughs> What Guardian of Galaxies want in return? Simple. Drop the charges. Contact Nova Corps HQ and get the world mind to forgive our fine. Then we'll go. It's not being so easy. <clears throat> Face it, dog breath. You need us. Us? For now. Unless you got someone else stupid enough to go. In Soviet Russia, Cosmo would not trust words of capitalist scum. But this is not motherland. And Cosmo no power of collateral. Guardian ship, stay on nowhere. What? You can't take our ship? My ship. How are we gonna find the Hallow's Hope? Ask Pesky Raccoon. Now come, essences of time. Exactly. To original settlement. From early days, before Kiva could come. You mean the first mining colony is still here? Duh. Now abandoned, mostly. Entirely restored. This is the place you broke into. Broke implies it took effort. Wait, this is the Continuum Cortex? It's the best way to reach Nova Ship before moves again. You found Corel. Where is she? Nova Ship currently in the leader system, orbiting Michael planet. Contraxia. Cosmo not surprised. Pesky Raccoon enjoy garbage planet. Their restrooms do provide valuable information. Entire planet now broadcast same signal as Nova Rock. Cosmo not understand purpose or intention. All them bars and betting parlors and brothels. Maybe it's not such a bad thing after all. Cosmo paint to agree with Assassin. We can find Corel and save Contraxia. Maybe we shouldn't make too many guarantees. We're the Guardians of the Galaxy. This is what we do. I am with you, Peter Quill. You are? Of course. It was a rousing speech. Bootlicker. How many people know about this place? Enough. It's not broadcast across galaxy, but scientists come from many backgrounds. If Thanos had known this was here... Ah, dead Titan King no longer concerned for cloth. I am surprised the rodent was able to bypass your security systems. Pisky. So, what is this? Like another elevator? Oh, no. They'll figure it out. Please to stand back, Guardian of Galaxies. Whoa! Witchcraft is this? <laughs> I know. It's like they've never seen a giant transdimensional hand before. Please, to step in ball. What if things go sideways? How do we get back? With passport. Can communicate with Cosmo, and if emergency, bring Guardian of Galaxies back. Better you take it than Captain Valor over here. This time, investigate Nova Ship. Use passport to report findings. And you'll speak to the world mind? Get rid of that fine, right? Those won't do the best. Good luck, Guardian of Galaxies. Anyone see any seatbelts? You better not throw off this time. This is 
Sorcery? I was going to say dizzying. I am broke. You get used to it. Are we in space? We're somewhere between space, between dimensions, between time, between uh, realities, even. What do you mean, between? We could theoretically go wherever and whenever we want to Even the places that don't exist, but uh, do. It's incredible. What kind of name is Avengers? Is that sound normal? <laughs> normal? You ain't heard nothing yet. Oh, Pat Benatar and John Jett watch over us. Who are these gods you speak of? Goddesses. <laughs> uh, Drax? <laughs> I am not the one laughing. It's obviously a new omen of our impending deaths. No matter where you hide, I will fight. No. Or it's an alternate reality. <laughs> I know that sound. I am proud. Definitely an alternate reality. Hey, help! It's Spider Man! Wait, is that Earth? Mom? Come on, you're deep for the promise here. Come on in, Janie. Peter will be up in a second. Really? Janie? Okay. Next stop, Alice Hope. Probably. Hold on, Groot. Here we go. <gasps> Flark and Alice! Spread. Okay, here we go! Whoa! Oh, Flark! Correct. You guys okay? Do we look okay? Well, hang in there. I'll try to restore gravity. Oh, great. We're gonna be stuck like this forever. Rocket, buddy, what am I looking for? Drax, tell Scut Lord most ships use external power conduits to generate pseudo gravity in hyperbaric airlocks. The beast says to find a power conduit. Right, and what do those look like? Tell him any vestiges of power should show up on his visor. And to stop asking so many blocking questions, to get us down from here. Might be just what we need. Found some kind of battery. Looks undamaged. Could be useful. Someone tell Scott Lord to hold on to it. Hold on to it, Peter Quill. Something terrible happened here. What gave it away? The lack of gravity or the general destruction? I'm not seeing anything useful. Somebody tell him I ain't gonna do all this work for him. Use your visor, Peter. More, but nothing's happening. Seriously? Uh, fine. Uh, there's a blue wire and two connections, yellow and red, and one big green thing. Don't touch the green thing! Not a great time to start yelling, dude! Okay, okay. First, plug the wire to either connection. All we need is a little jump start. To either one? It's not brain sir. Uh, here goes nothing! Oh, crap! Not restore at one job, Will. I did exactly what.
If I had any units, I'd bet that Mutt knew what we were getting into here. Impressive, Peter Quill. I didn't know you could do that. Neither did I. Those firearms are becoming quite formidable. Second time they've transformed like that. Third. If that was the third time, when was the first? The day I was kidnapped. When my mom died. We should continue our investigation for the dog. We'll need to get this wreckage out of the way first. Groot's right. Should move if we give it a jolt. Should we call Cosmo? Let him know what we found so far? What do you mean a code word? Fine. Groot won't call the mud until we all agree on a code word. Could be useful if we get cornered by whatever's on the ship. How about Quill Kill? Ooh, oh! The code word is Ride the Stars. And we should hold off calling Cosmo until we figure out what's going on. This is the only way out, but the door's got no juice. Must be on a different circuit. Dog report item. Something caused Nova Corps to abandon their ship. Maybe they all just quit. Some people don't give up when things start going wrong. There, you all felt that, right? Yep. Dast. Looks just like what happened on the rock. Indeed. It was a desperate attempt at a last defensive position. Everything that happened seems to be connected to this ship. Maybe your girlfriend went crazy after seeing you. I doubt Peter Quill could inspire this level of mutiny. Okay, we need to get to Corell's office. Someone tell Quill... Come on, dude. Can't we just talk to each other? Knew this would come in handy. Where'd you get a Nova passkey? Nikki gave it to me, to keep it away from her mom. We could sell that. It must be worth a couple thousand units. Do you know what Nova Corps does to people who steal from them? Look around. How much you want to bet there aren't enough Nova left to execute us? Let's see what we can make with the parts you've got. It's all yours. Now that was some quality crafting, if I might say so myself. Perhaps this all began in the quarantine zone. What do you mean? It is a logical point of origin. I wish I knew the layout of this tub better. Then we could figure out where this started. You know where we are, Gamora? Not really. Anova never really let me out of their sight. They had good reason not to trust me. This again? I was only stating that Nova's position of not trusting me is accurate. The longer we bicker, the more we might miss. Very inspirational. Yeah, you get that off a of placemat? All I'm saying is we're in this up to our necks, and we'll need to work together to get out of it. Dog report item. Strange rumbling on ship continues. Maybe keep track of your items mentally? That is what I am doing. He means... <sighs> Never mind. No wonder we've been stumbling around in the dark. Whoa! Ho, ho. Look at you, you sexy beast. Ah, flirting rocket. Is it supposed to be upside down? Uh, only if you wanted to channel all the ship's power up through the ceiling. Makes no sense to me. There must be a reason. A bad one. Try that console. Uh, we can use this to re-invert the core, or uh, uh, de-invert... Uh, de de-vert? Rocket. Uh, the console's safety locked because the mounting arms are retracted. If we can pop them out of them side panels, we can flip the core. Huh. Looks like the arms are stuck without any power. I bet we could jumpstart him. How? Gotta be a power cell somewhere. It is time. Here it comes. For Peter Quill's mask to guide us with its mysterious power. Ain't nothing mysterious about it. I programmed the Dastin thing. There's gotta be more machinery up there. Gamora, give me a boost. Of course. Huh. Huh. <laughs> 
Definitely something up here. Obviously. Yep. Found the power cell. Just gotta power it up and the arms don't extend. Hell yeah, it works! You know, them guns would make better engineering tools than weapons. Nice try. Let's get the other one free. All right, Gamora, let's get the second one done. Okay. Find a way up there and discover why, for the dog report. Rocket, what's that console telling you? That you should come do the honors. Oh, uh, surprise! This whole thing's a lift. We can ride it all the way up there. I guess Nova grunts and grease monkeys don't get the cool flying suits. Typical. Nobody respects their engineers these days. If you want efficiency, you gotta make... Whoa! Mark! Orgy clamps! They're shutting us down! More freaks approach! Lord, just e re inverted the core again. We just have to re e re invert it back. After we take some heads. Rip them off the backs. Death has come. Definitely not the Nova Core I was hoping to find here. No, they're exactly who I expected. Long on you, Sky. Impossible! Circumvent electrical hazards! Carve him a new one! Feel this! I will handle them all! Do not let them distract you! Right! Because who doesn't want to get shot in the back? Stay on the Starting to wonder if there's anybody left in the Omicor who isn't crazy! Horror movie rules, people! Do what you gotta do to survive! The shield is the mine. It's enough already. Move oh, away, Let's kill this guy. Don't touch this. Another great Nova Corps soldier. No.
cold too, anyways. Other than being a duck. Whoa! Mark! Mark clamps! They're shutting us down! More freaks approach! Lorkers de re inverted the core again! We just have to re de re invert it back! After we take them ahead! <laughs> Get down before we alert the whole ship! Yes! Three more! Let's even the odds! Yeah, you might want to dodge those next time! Will this be added to our permanent records? Tear into them! Rachel's gonna give us a clean slate! Perhaps you should avoid that electrical yeah. wizardry! It'll be a slide! That bloody my guy's really starting to tick me off! Come on, feel my wrath! Some of these people may have been war heroes! We'll make sure they get a heroic death! I require your help! We're up to Scott Hill! This is all our wrath! Those mines are gonna be an issue! Get off me! You scut nothing flock bag! You're welcome! Right tight! Bombs away, Mark! Definitely not the Nova Corps I was hoping to find here! No, they're exactly who I expected! Slice and dice! Get the point? There's only room for one bomb crossing bag! I got you, Drax! Watch the mine! Make your peace! Yeah. I bet on our tech over that Nova Junk any day! Our brains are the superior technology! Eyes on the prize, Peter! I knew you had my back! It. It's not the shield, it's the mine! Enough already! So, let's take that sprint next to right. Let's get those clamps off so we can keep moving. I will tear them from their sockets. Ain't gonna work, Musclehead. But this time, we've got a control room to play with. Looks like I can remove the clamps from here. Good. We will not be stopped by clamps. Ah, sneaky dash bags. They scrambled the power circuit so I can't release them. I'm tired of these clamps. Gonna have to reroute the circuits one by one to reset the power grid. Here, I'll get the door for you. You should be able to see the grid with your visor. Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. Kinda wondering why Cosmo didn't fetch a bunch of his muscle to do this himself. It is simple. He required professionals. Yeah. The poocher don't even need to lift the paw to take down Lady Elvander's invincible goons needs us. Gamora! Rocket, can you blast through the wall here? Drax, I need a hole here to reach the grave. And you will have one! This would go a lot faster if we all had the ability to scan. Yeah, you got any, uh, priceless Lattice Hex Ornadian crystals lying around? No, we ain't got any. We only have the one. What do your goggles do? That's classified. <laughs> got a locked door. Can you open it? No. Can you wrap power to it? Not from here. I'll try to find a way around. Everybody stay alert. Quill has a knack for pushing in the wrong buttons or crossing the wrong wires. The small hairy one is insinuating you are bad luck. Funny how the small hairy one is always right there guiding me. Peter Quill is insinuating that you, Weasel, could be the cause of our problems. Ugh. Hurry it up, Quill. Lumpy's bugging everybody with his color commentary. I am 
tired. Groot's right. Maybe we should just call Cosmo, tell him we tried, and report the Flark out of here. It ain't our fault Scut was locked down. We will not fail at our mission. I mean, that sounds great and all, but we usually fail at our missions. Not this time. Our work here is important. You know, normally, you're not supposed to travel through dimensions without a quarantine and a decompression on the other side. Should we be concerned? Just keep an eye out for the warning signs. Mental degradation, paranoia, aggressive behavior. I feel like that's already an accurate description of our team. How will we tell? Groot, I think I have an idea. Use your roots to raise that platform with me on it. Kind of a root root boost thing. Neat trick. Groot loves being helpful. He's always helpful. Up we go. Okay, I bet I can reroute the power to get myself back out of here. Solid plan. Hell yeah, who's smarter than Novacore? with a paintbrush or a mop? Neither. I use explosives. Somebody else does the mop. Oh, hey there. Anyone else feeling ready to move on? Yep, indubitably. that open so is there any chance of quill getting back together with lady law <laughs> she's no lady she'd never set her standards untrue. Did that do anything? Not yet. We'll have to reroute a couple of them. Doors open, and I got the power flowing through. Almost qualified to be a junior engineer. Thanks. I see it now. We've got half of it rerouted. Now work on the other room. Okay, 
I'm getting the hang of this. Might be gunning for your job soon. You want to trade? I'm happy to sit in the captain's seat. You frequently sit in the captain's seat. I did not just hear that. Buddy, root boost, please. I am Groot. You can stop there. Thanks. I am Groot. Looks like you did it, Star Man. Now get into the control room and hit that clamp release. I'll re reinvert the core at the same time. Get us moving. Clamps are unclamped. Slick. Now get back in here before we leave you behind. Yeah, let's see how far you get without your button pusher. Now that we know the infected Nova are here, we can agree that whatever's going on upstairs is really bad, right? They were furious when we removed their power source. It must be important to their effort here. Can't wait to smash it. Whatever it is. And then get back the Cosmo for our reward. All right, this is our floor. Doors are sealed tight. Gamora, can you pry that thing open for us? And bend my sword? Drax, hit that panel where all the wires connect. <laughs> Step aside. Come out to the coast. We'll get together, have a few laughs. What's that? Uh, nothing. No, that. They must have flipped the core back. Something's powering up again. Now we're stuck in the ventilation. Great job, Quill. Dude, I know you're peeved, and I'm sorry. Apology accepted. Really? That's it? In case you hadn't noticed, there's more important things happening right now than Quill saying he's sorry. Whoa! Flark and Scott! What are these fragment gaboons doing to Contraxia? What is this thing, Rocket? I don't know. Looks like it's siphoning something. Something to do with those cubes? We have been in this hangar before. It's like they're stocking up on something. What the floor? So what is it? I think they're using the ray to fill some kind of battery. Standard galactic I.O. ports. Regalian glass mat separators. Cree cathodes. I understood some of those words. I ain't never seen nothing like it! Energy readings are all over the place, but I can't tell what kind of energy it is! Dog report item. Massive device siphoning energy from Contraxia. Don't forget the energy cubes! Dog report item. Energy stored in strange cubes. I still do not understand what could lead to all this. Some kind of mutiny, but it doesn't add up for me either. Dog report item. The assassin and I agree on something. Groot! 
We need to check out that giant raid thing! Can you get us across? <laughs> Taking out the entire ship! Let's avoid the scary beam! Good advice! Guardian of Galaxies, Cosmo Checky. Investigation lead him to believe Alaho is key to galaxy mystery. What is that noise? We are compiling an extensive dog report. Atraxia isn't looking so good. They're killing it is what they're doing. Tell Cosmo what... Uh-oh. What is... Uh-oh. Piotr Quinn. Something just came up. We'll call you back. Your experience <coughs> fighting Centurions will be necessary here. <coughs> Only one well. Not going into the light this time, little buddy. Round him up, crew! What? Interesting. They are no match for these blades, Peter Quill. All right, all right, listen. This isn't our first rodeo, guys. Problem is, if we play it cocky, one little mistake is gonna bring us down. So let's get back out there, give this fight complete dedication, and make them scream. Who's with me? I am with you, Peter this Quill. This is gonna be fun! Great! Stop the sword, Patrax! Kick I that boy! Oh, come on, really? A Centurion? I'd have hoped the Centurion would have resisted whatever this is. Put him up, Gamora! Turn her up! Well, just look at this now. now! Maybe you've seen her? Now is not the time for conversation! Let Chase loose, me! Rocket. Corral, get some real answers. You have any idea where she is?
thinking we check her office. I even know how we can get there. Way out of the hangar. Yeah, same way me and Nikki went last time we were here. You know, we never did talk about why you jumped after her, Peter. Uh, because it was the right thing to do. We should hurry. More zealots could arrive at any moment. The hole we saw should be on the other side of these moving batteries. Gonna need to find a way to stop. Start looking around. Rocket, can you see where that vent leads? Anything to get out of here. We should be prepared in case the beast tries to destroy this machinery. There you go. I've done my part. Yeah, thanks. Keep in mind, we may not stay dead forever. We still need a Drax, gonna need you to drag this over. I will assume you have a plan. Ah, I see what you were thinking, Peter Quill. We can use the crane to grab a battery. Uh, right. Just like I planned. Dog report item. The rumbling. Just like I thought. Impressive work, Peter Quill. Just hope it does not cause an explosion. Well, let's not stick around to find out. All right, come on, the tunnel's just past here. We got lucky no one else showed up. The Unifier has detected an intrusion. Spread out. It will be contained. By, by her, her will. will. Move! There's too many of them. In the hole! Jump! Still don't get why you jumped after the kid back then. Top ten dumbest things I ever saw you do. You should have seen how worried he was. Hey, Star Pants was our ticket with the captain. I was worried his death would lead to more jail time. It was adorable. I hate you all. Pretty sure this is right. Pretty sure? Everything was on fire last time. I couldn't make that happen. No, no. Rocket, no! 
Ain't that a piece of the Unifier's old ship? Unifier. Yeah, whatever. When we were arrested, they mentioned Raker got caught for the same thing we did. Not exactly the same. He got caught scavenging in the quarantine zone. How is that not the same? Forget Raker. Our focus right now is finding Nikki. Your focus? My focus is not dying on this stupid ship. The dog wants us to find Centurion co Realm. Right. So we're multitasking. I did not realize you were going so far. I didn't fall. I jumped. Heroically. One more time, Groot. Let's go find Corel and Nikki. So, any new ideas on what the oversized vacuum is actually doing to contract you? So, we all agree that the captain and her kid are probably dead, right? Corel survived the worst of the war. And a relationship with Peter. Still willing to bet they didn't survive this. You'd wager on whether or not a mother and child are dead. But if only one is dead? You don't think this is slightly inappropriate, given Peter's history? Nikki's one of the most resourceful kids I ever met. Whoa! Watch out! You okay? I am Groot. Groot says we should start thinking about exit plans. The exit plan is to call Cosmo after we get the answers we need. Answers you need, maybe. Don't suppose you've seen Nikki? I'm sorry, what? You feeling okay, Peter? Does not strike me as very safe here, Peter Quill. Better this than getting shot at. Eh, speak for yourself. You'd rather get shot at? More fulfilling to shoot someone I don't like than look for someone I don't care about. Our leader seems to care, and so we should also pretend to care. I am <sighs> Of course you would. Careful, Peter Quill. Okay, don't remember this green gas being here last time. I think you mean deadly green gas. This whole ship's a death trap now. There, breezy peasy. Okay, that was bad, even for you. Ah, more death gas. Maybe Nikki and Corral are using it to protect themselves. Or, and... Hear me out on this. Maybe they're dead. You know what, man? You're being a real jackass, like, way more than usual. Tension is palpable. Oh, can you both please get over this? Agreed. Either resolve your issues or fight to the death. Look, Rocket. I know I suck sometimes. We all suck sometimes. Pretty sure it's why we ended up together. I do not suck. Point is... I care about us, but right now we're not the ones in danger. And Nikki's just a kid, man. As long as we're clear on the you sucking part. Clear as day. Just keep your eyes open. You know, Peter, if Nikki and Krell really are... They're not. I'm just saying we should be ready for anything. They're not. Report by the 
rumbling continues. Or Contraxia. Did you find a dog report item? No, nothing dog report worthy. Still no signs of Nikki or Corral. In the face of death's infinite mystery, Tapia's are taught to focus on what is tangible. I'll keep that in mind. Sure, this is the right way, Will. It's clearly not. I'm investigating. Here, this is definitely the right way. Nikki's secret hideout is just through here. Thought we were going to the captain's office. We are. Right after we check here. Try not to break anything. This place means a lot to her. Oh, wow. Didn't Nikki paint all this? Pretty cool, right? Nikki? Little one, reveal yourself. Maybe try being a little less scary. It's Peter! The... the pirate? Nikki! We do not intend to kill you. We need to get into that room. Two for two! Thank you, Nikki's passkey. <sighs> Careful, Peter Quill. In my experience, children often booby trap their toys. It's not Nikki's, it's mine. So we're just claiming our stuff now? Because if we are. No, I mean it literally used to belong to me. Uh, Quill, you gotta see this. This kid's obsessed with you. Wait, why does she have your toy? It's just something I gave to Corral when we were together during the war, like a keepsake. It doesn't mean anything. Does, uh, this mean anything? How old is the child? Twelve. Ha! Congratulations, Peter Quill! You will make a terrible father. Unless the child is dead, in which case, it does not matter. W wait Is this why you dragged us here? Clearly. The child is twelve. Yes, okay. So the dates maybe kind of match up, so it's possible, I guess. It's only they had a health class on this. Inspiring. Can we just focus on if Corell and Nikki are okay? They're clearly not here, so let's move on and keep looking. Anyone else feel weird going through Nikki's stuff like this? Peter Quill is her father. It is his duty to pry into her personal life. Pretty sure she ain't here, Quill. I think he's still processing. Got you covered. Doing, doing. Okay. Where were we? Done. Congratu Should be a way to Corral's office through those pipes on the left. Yeah, I see an opening. Could be there's a latch on the inside. Allow me, Star Dad. <laughs> I get it. <laughs> Guys. Not make light of all this? Got to admit it, Quill. Kid's whole setup is pretty impressive. The way she rigged her terminal to the emergency power grid. I told you, she's a smart kid. Perhaps Peter Quill did not sire this child after all. Yeah, I could see that. She just don't seem dopey enough. Maybe she gets everything from the mother's side. Yes, she should have exhibited at least some foolishness. If I had a kid, she or he would definitely be super cool and smart. So 
so just like Nikki. I guess, maybe, yes. That's the elevator I took with Corel and Nikki. If we're lucky, maybe they're on their way down right now. When have we ever been lucky? Someone for your one It did seem unlikely. All I know is I am really starting to hate this elevator. Bust it open the Nova Corps crackpot! These renegades are relentless! Welcome, Death! Seems like we're due for a check-in with Cosmo! Definitely feel that we've learned some new things! But the rest of you already know that Peter Bell was the child's father! Do we really have to talk about this now? So was this a coincidence, or did they know we were coming? Hurt? What? Are you gonna start being all paternal now? We're fine, Peter. We know how to fight. I know, I, I just... We'll find them. Next stop, Corel's office. Come on, just admit it, Quill. You're freaking out right now. This whole deadbeat dad thing's got to be eating at you. The prospect of maybe being a dad is a little scary. A little? Embrace the panic, Peter Quill. It is the essence of fatherhood. Well, that don't look good. There was a struggle here. Uh, yeah, that's what I'm reacting to? I am reacting in my own way. This doesn't look good, Peter. All we know is that there was a fight. We don't know who won. Pretty sure I know. So, where's this office, Quill? It's around here somewhere. Place wasn't this messed up last time. When in doubt, follow the stench of death. Side. Longer it hello Corral Nikki Looks empty. Feels empty. Maybe they're hiding. There are always strange writings on the wall. I'm gonna try and get in her computer. See if I can wipe my criminal history. Rocket! I'm kidding. I'm gonna access her logs. You wanna know what happened here or not? Fine. The rest of us will take a look around. Maybe they left a clue or something. The scribbles are Cree. This one says, Mother knows best. Return, hope, promise. What is this? Some kind of a threat? The Cree Council demands proof of Nikki's heritage under the Cree purity laws. What Cree purity laws? Corel never told you that either? The Cree are extremely strict about their bloodlines. This does not look good. For you? No. For Nikki. What are the chances the Kree are involved in any of this? The Council of Purity isn't cryptic. When they punish someone, they make sure everyone knows it. Corel and Nikki would be hanging from a wall. Some kind of dye machine. Is it normal for Kree to dye their hair? Not unless they're hiding something. Nikki's ID. Something seems off, though. What do you mean, off? I don't know. Like it's been flagged or something. Not sure. Is the girl's date of birth on those documents? Does it match with the typical Cree gestation period? I really wouldn't know. Oh, wow! The Cree have comic books? I am surprised. The Cree Council is very strict on approved forms of entertainment. So this could be, like, super valuable, then. How valuable are we talking? Nikki? Obvious signs of a struggle, Peter Quill. Yeah, this doesn't look good. Ah, appealing.
Any luck getting in? Things pretty well protected. I need time. All right, let me know. Are you seriously focused on food right now? Mystery makes me hungry. Hey, save me some, will ya? The resemblance is uncanny. She doesn't look anything like me. She's blue. Besides, why wouldn't Corral have just told me? Protect her daughter, Peter Quill. Copulating with you was a capital offense under the Cree purity laws. Oh, right. That. So when Corral said we shouldn't be doing this... He was being literal. Okay, I'm in. But I got bad news, lover boy. What did you find? Come here and I'll show you. So what am I looking at? Nothing. She's the captain. Captains keep logs. You keep logs? I I'm trying to tell you, they're gone. All of them. Almost like the world mind went out of its way to sever everything. Have you tried turning it off and on? What about backups? Doesn't every Nova ship have a central hub or something? A Nexus mainframe, yeah. If there's ghosts anywhere in the system, that's where. I categorically refuse. Not literal ghost, Drax. He's talking about data. Right? Yes, but we'd have to access the Nexus directly. Means going to the bridge. We're not leaving until we find out what happened. Center of operations it is. According to the ship's map, the bridge should be right through here. Dog report item. It's one of them priests down there, ain't it? Oh, crap. Uh, nuts to this. I'm out of here. Stop moving. A warrior does not hesitate, Peter Quill. Okay, let's be careful. He says after you. Shh. Voices down. Thinking that Baker's church is definitely involved. Clearly, the 
question remains, how exactly? We can switch to the hard stuff! Any last words? With pleasure! For future reference, you guys really need to work on yourself! Hey! I'm not the one who broke the glass! Can't even crush that thing! The contraption cannot predict our merciless unity! Ha! Brutify a brute! You don't stand a ch- Are we thinking this thing can brainwash people? I do not feel brainwashed right now. I feel shot at. We must tell the dog about the priest. Robot priest. I am Groot. Groot says the mutt's not answering. Keep trying. The rest of us can focus on figuring a way out. Really? This is the server room, right? And servers mean data? I can't just plug servers into my skull. I still need a central terminal. You said the bridge was on the other side of that corridor. That'll do it. Well played, Peter Quill. How am I supposed to know why the pooch ain't picking up? Keep trying. It's weird, right? Okay, so according to the map I saw, Nexus should be just above us. Uh, shall I throw the road in? No! Come on! Uh, All right, let's look around. Maybe we can find something. Man, what I would give to get into some of these servers. I thought that was the plan. Plan is to get to the bridge and hope that maybe someone left the Nexus unlocked. Wouldn't get my hopes up. I have never understood how so much information in such a magical way. What, you mean servers? All of it. Servers, computers, technology. There's an open panel up in the corner there. Pretty sure that's our exit. Perfect. So we just gotta jump across a few of these floaty server things? Seems, uh, perfectly safe. They contain near infinite stores of data. Pretty sure they can temporarily support our puny mortal frames. Well, mine anyway. <laughs> And yours too, yes. To think, all of this could have been avoided had the rodent not broken the glass. You're blaming him for that? His panic scampering is what caused the final break. Your oversized gut is what caused the first 50 breaks! Guys! Pretty sure it was already cracked. Hey Groot, any luck getting through to Cosmo yet? I am Groot. Nope, still nothing. Reception will probably be better once we're on the bridge. Yeah, I don't think that's how it works. Okay, this is it, the command center. Which I guess makes that the Nexus control terminal. Fingers crossed we find something useful. I'm thinking you should do the honors, Quill. Locked. I wonder, though. Nikki really didn't want her mom to know about this pass key she gave me. No way is some kid's card gonna bypass the Nexus. Then we're in! You're kidding. Well, yes! Guys, we're in! Go to the criminal records, Quill. I want to see my files. So, Drax's criminal record is pretty big. That is what your mother said. <laughs> it's great, because his mother's dead. I thought there'd be more here. Barely scratches the surface. I am gold. You? <laughs> A gold dome? Over my dead body, buddy. You know, for a non-spacefaring species, us humans sure get around. Hey, isn't that the guy we saw when we tried to pay our fine? Look, it's Drax's girlfriend. Lady Hellbender is not my girlfriend. Yet. Isn't this your friend from the bar? Yep. Grand Unifier Raker. Wonder what he was looking for in the quarantine zone. Probably nothing good. Read it and weep, losers. There ain't a single scam me and Groot haven't pulled off. You name it, we've done it. 
If you're charged, it means you've been caught. You realize that, right? Wow. When Cree cops go bad, they really go bad. Actually, an accuser is the equivalent of a judge, jury, and executioner. Wow. Your record's a lot bigger than I expected. How big were you expecting? Minuscule. Another guy from Earth. I'm telling you, Quill, C-53 is the trailer park of the galaxy. Fun fact, that bounty on you put out is how me and Groot met Quill. I'm just glad I talked you out of collecting it. I am unfamiliar with this Kree. One of the nameless. Oh, spooky. Get to the juicy stuff already. Channeling your Nova Force. A, a comprehensive, comprehensive guide to meditation, meditation and, and managing your mental health. Actually, I wouldn't mind a copy of that. Pass. Let me get this straight. She became a teapot? That's what my source said. <laughs> well, that don't say. Attention, away team. Please ensure your helmet cams are in full operation ahead of this afternoon's away mission into the quarantine zone. It's a list of bucket heads. Uh, we already know your girlfriend works here, Quill. Check it out. I have heard of this one. She crashed into a Leviathan on purpose and is still a better pilot than Quill. All right, let's take a look. Isn't that the mining rig from the quarantine zone? Oh, great. Looks like your girlfriend was collecting evidence against us even after the two of you struck a deal. Gotta be something in... Hey, isn't that... The mining ship we explored in the quarantine zone, yeah. What is the footage from? Signal stronger. We must be close. How close? Hard to say. There's too much interference. Centurion Corral! Found something. Hey! What are you- Watch out! after we left. Flark. That thing. You don't think. It is the creature that devoured our monster. <laughs> Could have been a million things. I mean, it's restricted space for a reason. I'm Groot. No, you're a Lotus Scut. That thing's got nothing to do with us. That gem Corral picked up. I think it's the same one we shot in the quarantine zone. Uh, we? You're the one who shot it. Fine, the gem I shot. The point is, is that shadow thing came out of it. We did this. The quarantine zone's a giant death trap. So, we released a shadow thing. We made it out, didn't we? Your stupid girlfriend probably did too. You've been saying the whole time she's probably dead. Eh, probably alive, probably dead, whatever. Important thing is, we're all fine. Corel is tough. If anyone made it out, it's her. I know it. Read our intentions. No, you've made them pretty clear. Sometimes sacrifices. I had the check. Groot, write the stars. Grand Unifier. Breaker. Right? First, let me just say it's really cool that you've heard of us, right, guys? And it's cool that you didn't try to kill us just then, especially with your two pals right there. 
could have totally ripped us apart the moment you walked in. Which we obviously all appreciate. But also, we've kind of got a few questions, like... Where are Centurion Corel and her daughter? You came here seeking truth. Rejoice. The Matriarch wishes to share it with you. Tathian warriors often ride into battle completely naked. Keep your pants on. Although it could be used as a distraction. Yeah, no. Any other ideas? Can you froth? I can froth. Can you twitch? Yeah, I'm pretty twitchy. All right. On my cue, you drop, froth, and twitch. While they're all distracted, we take off down one of them side halls. What about me? You, well, you know, you, uh, take one for the team. I'm not gonna... Walk with me! Come on, Quill, just grab your chest and drop. Find another plan. 